Welcome to our video about the magnificent and mysterious structures of ancient Egypt, the pyramids. These ancient architectural wonders have captivated people for thousands of years with their sheer size and architectural prowess. From the Great Pyramid of Giza, one of the seven wonders of the world, to the smaller pyramids scattered across the land, Egypt's pyramids stand as a testament to the ingenuity and skill of the ancient Egyptians. In this video, we will delve into the history and purpose of these ancient structures, as well as explore some of the unique features that make each pyramid unique. So sit back, relax, and get ready to discover the amazing world of Egyptian pyramids. Introduction There are many different pyramids that exist around the world. The most famous pyramids are located in Egypt and they were built by ancient Egyptians. The oldest of these is known as the Pyramid of Khufu, also known as Cheops. The pyramid was built during the 4th dynasty and was completed after 10 years. The second largest pyramid in Egypt is known as the Pyramid of Khafra, or Shephron, which is located near Cairo on the west bank of the Nile River. It stands about 45 meters high and has a base length of 215 meters making it almost twice as large than its neighboring pyramid at Giza, the Great Pyramid, also called Khufu's, which only measures 138 meters long on each side at its base though it rises some 482 feet above ground level today because soil has been steadily accumulating on top over thousands of years due to windblown sand grains raining down from nearby deserts but even so erosion continues unabatedly still today just like always has done so anyway what else do you know about them already? Pyramids are located in Egypt The pyramids are located in Giza, Egypt. Giza is southwest of Cairo and is the most popular tourist attraction in Egypt. There are many other pyramids in Egypt, they were built from stone, sand and bricks. The oldest of the seven wonders of the world The pyramids are the oldest of the seven wonders of the world, and they're still around today. There are several theories about how they were built and why, but no one knows for sure what happened thousands of years ago. The pyramids were built by Egyptians during their civilization's early days between 2900 BCE and 2500 BCE. They were made with huge stones that weighed tons. These stones were transported from quarries located near Cairo and Aswan, in southern Egypt. The Great Pyramid was finished in 2560 BC, while others finished later than that date, around 2500 BC. Built by ancient Egyptians The ancient Egyptians are the ones who built the pyramids. They were the first people to build them and had a lot of technology back then, so they were able to use their technology in order for them to be able to build these large structures made from stone, sand and bricks The pyramids were made from stone, sand and bricks. The stones used for the building of the pyramids are mainly limestone. The mud and straw bricks were made by slaves. The pharaohs of ancient Egypt built the pyramids as tombs for themselves so that they could live forever in the afterlife. Were tombs for pharaohs, king and queen's pyramids were built as tombs for pharaohs, kings and queens. They also served as temples to honor the gods. Pyramids had many purposes, burial places places where priests could live were built as a way to protect their bodies for an afterlife. The pyramids were built for pharaohs and queens to protect their bodies for an afterlife. They were also built as tombs for the pharaohs, so that they could be buried in a place where they would be safe from natural disasters and thieves. The Egyptians believed that after death, if you had not been properly buried in your tomb then your soul would not have anywhere to go but down into the underworld where it would be trapped forever by Osiris, the god who rules over this world. This meant that if you wanted your soul to go on living after death then it was important that you made sure everything was done correctly before being laid to rest inside one of these magnificent structures. Most popular pyramids are at Giza, southwest of Cairo. The pyramids at Giza are the most popular, and for good reason. They're the oldest of the seven wonders of the world and still standing today. The only ones that are left standing among all those built thousands of years ago. The Great Pyramid, also called Khufu's Pyramid, was built around 2560 BC, while its two smaller companions were erected around 20 years later. Their construction required an estimated 2 million blocks weighing between 2 and 15 tons each. The Great Pyramid was originally 481 feet high, 147 meters, but now stands at 455 feet due to erosion over time. Its base covers 13 acres, 5 hectares. It's impossible to know exactly how many people worked on it because we don't have any written records from ancient times detailing how they were made. However, estimates range from 20,000 up to 100,000 workers during different stages of construction depending on what kind of tools were used and whether slaves or paid laborers were employed. Many people still don't know how they were actually built. The question of how the pyramids were built is one that has been debated for centuries. Some people think they were built by aliens, while others believe it was a lost civilization. 
a third group says that a mixture of both these theories must be correct. The truth is, we don't know exactly how they were constructed because there are no written records or eyewitnesses left behind to tell us what happened thousands of years ago in Egypt, and even if there were, their accounts would likely be biased. However, archaeologists have uncovered evidence that helps us understand how each theory could have been possible. The history behind them is still a mystery the history behind the pyramids is still a mystery, but we do know that they were built over a period of 100 years. The first pyramid was built in 2630 BC and the last one was built in 1660 BC. The oldest pyramid is the Step Pyramid at Saqqara and it dates back to 2630 BC. The Egyptians used ramps and sledges to haul blocks up pyramid sides. This process required much less manpower than moving stones up stairs or ladders, which would have been far too steep for people carrying heavy loads on their backs or shoulders. As we bring this video about the Egyptian pyramids to a close, it's important to remember the enduring impact these structures have had on the world. The pyramids stand as a testament to the achievements of the ancient Egyptians and the ingenuity of the human spirit. These structures have survived for thousands of years, and continue to inspire awe and wonder in all who behold them. So as we bid farewell to this video, we hope that you have gained a deeper appreciation for the Egyptian pyramids and their place in history. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the magnificent world of ancient Egypt.